Hello everybody, welcome to third, the third day in the Anchorage special. And I hope I unmuted the microphone, hopefully. Uh, I'm gonna be hearing my uh, I'm gonna be hearing myself on the playback in just a few seconds. Hopefully it's not another no, another embarrassing moment. Uh, welcome to the third day everybody. Now earlier in the day. Hey Kat, can you check if my lapel's on? Oh boy, it might have been muted. Test, test, one, two, three. Okay, it's on. Okay, so this is the third day of LA Flights Live at Anchorage. The home of the One More Plane brings the show from Los Angeles all the way to Anchorage. Freighter Heaven, 747 Heaven as well. Now, earlier in the show, I had a show planned, early bird special. I was going to do a show from 7 a.m. until maybe midday. The thing is... All right, so we have a lot of planes in front of us. Now, the thing is, everyone, as you saw a big buffering event, I am doing my best to uh, hook up the broadcast from this location. This is such a special location, but the signal strength is not the strongest. A lot stronger from our locations back on Saturday and Sunday. I'm going to do my best. If you see that buffering wheel, I'm going to do my best to keep that show going. A lot of 4K content has been filmed from this, con so from this location, so we will take a look at this location at a, little, a later date. Sadly, we did, ra okay, so we did run a test before. We went live. Every everything was running smoothly for like 45 minutes. And right now, well, it's not that smooth. If we encounter more buffering issues, I'm afraid we're going to have to end the broadcast. I hope not. I'm going to be crossing my fingers. I'm going to have, I'm going to have the faith. I'm going to keep the faith. Friendly vibes, everybody. Friendly vibes. Send your friendly vibes to the uh, internet connection. Such an incredible location, this. And when we found it, when we found this location, I just had to share it with all of you. Doing my absolute best, guys. Third day of the Anchorage special. I'm not even going to mention the internet signal. We're going to not even mention it let's not jinx anything right now it's kind of running smoothly so i'll take this any day of the week we have one two three queens of the skies we have three 747 right in front of us and we have an a330 lighting up on runway seven left Wamos Air flying to Mexico City, lining up on runway. Seven left. Arrivals are happening on seven right and departures are happening on seven left. Runway 33, the runway that we were at yesterday and Saturday closed down for the day. That's why we are exploring the city of Anchorage. We're exploring the airport, finding new locations to bring a show to all of you.
Once again, that A330 flying to Mexico City. We are in freighter heaven, everyone. I'm seeing a 777 FedEx cross runway 33 in the distance via taxiway Tango. That one far away. Let's go take a look at the planes that are pretty close to us. We have one, we have two, we have three 747s. The one lining up, China Airlines cargo flying. Flying, uh, hold on a minute, no flight information on this one. Flying to O'Hare International. Does the sound, my friends? Let me know of what you think of the sound here on LA Flights Live. Thank you so much, Katie. Thank you so much for sending us a $20 tip. A toy plane. It looks like you're almost on the runway. That one's so close to us, Katie. So close to us right now. Incredible sound, everybody. I'm muting your host. Enjoy the incredible sounds here on LA Flights Live.
All right, so right now I'm very, I'm being very quiet right now. I'm just letting all of you take in the incredible sounds that we have in front of us. We're gonna go to a 737, arriving on seven right. Let's go for the arrival. Alaska 93 flying in from Seattle, Washington. Let's go to the 777 FedEx. Holding short of runway seven left. UPS 747 crossing runway 33. Runway 33 closed on us. Closed the entire day. That's why we're not at the location that we were at yesterday for yesterday's show and Saturday's broadcast. Runway 33, where the action happens right in front of you, closed. So we had to improvise today. And we went all around Anchorage trying to find another location. I think we found a good location. Let me know if, you, if we found it. I think this is a good one. The thing with this location, the internet strength is horrible. There's no strength to speak about. So we're battling the internet connection. I hope you guys don't see that buffering wheel. If you do see that buffering wheel, don't worry. We'll be right back. Just give us a few seconds. I'm doing my best to bring you the third day of the Anchorage special here on LA Flights. Thank you so much, Gerben. Vogel, five euro super chat coming in. Thank you for the wonderful 747 show. Absolutely, my friend. Thank you so much, Ace Tone. $20 super sticker, that one. An amazing super sticker. Thank you, Ace Tone. Thank you for helping out the two brothers as they are very far away from home today. Freighter Heaven, everybody. Have I said that before? Have I said that this is 747 Heaven? We have American Airlines arriving on 7 right. American flying in from Dallas, Texas. A seven hour flight. FedEx 84 flying to Memphis, Tennessee this afternoon. That's a 777. A departure on 7 left. Let's go to the 747 taxiing right now. That 747, a 400 model flying to Kentucky. On taxiway Kilo. We love taxiway Kilo. That's 747 on a good old Kilo. Number two for departure. We have a little prop already lined up on 7 left.
Are you ready? Jeffrey sending us Jeffrey sending us an amazing tip through PayPal, a $50 tip. This donation is on behalf of those who want to make a donation but cannot for whatever reason. Jeffrey, you're amazing, my friend. Incredible love here on the LA Flights family. Jeffrey spreading that love. I'm going to read your message again. This donation on behalf of those of you who can't, who want but can't for whatever reason. You're incredible, my friend. You're incredible, Jeffrey. Jason, $25 tip. Thank you for the two brothers from Los Angeles. The two brothers from Los Angeles bringing the planes to all of you from different locations. That's what we do. That is what we do. I hope everybody has a good time during the third day of the Anchorage special here on LA Flight as we take the show on the road. Thank you, AJ, sending us a $4 tip. Anchorage Home Award, home of award-winning four-engine fun. I think I've lost count. How many? I think that's the fifth one we've seen in the past few minutes. Let me know if you guys can hear the uh, if you can hear me well and hear the ATC. I think the jet noise. I think the main microphone, the the microphone that we use to capture the airplane sounds. I think that one a little too loud. Let me know if I need to adjust it, or do you like the full sound level of the uh, jet noise? Let me know if the sound level is a okay. We're going to stay with that 747 for just a few more seconds. We have Alaska Airlines, a 737 already lined up on 7 left. We're going to stay with you for just a few more seconds. Joshua taking that executive decision, and we're going to go for it. We're going to go to the 737. Already lined up. Oh, that first thousand likes. You know this is the channel where your host is obsessed with the like button. You know this is that channel. If you haven't done so, please leave a like if you like what you see. Let's cross the first 1,000 likes. It won't be in record time, but it will be below the first hour. Let's see. 1,000 likes. Now, if we cross 1,000 likes in the first, in the next few minutes, it's going to be the second quickest time we've ever hit 1,000 likes. Go for it. Let's try and make this the second quickest to 1,000.
Get ready. Prop noise. Oh, this is the jet. And it looks like a Learjet right next to us. Incredible sound coming right up. It's right next to us. Do you guys want another 747? Well, it's right now crossing runway 33, the runway that's closed right now, coming right at us. A departure on seven left in the next few minutes. I think this will be a good day, the third day in the Anchorage special here on LA Flights Live. Thank you so much, Bruce McAbee. A five Aussie super chat flying home to Melbourne in just under an hour. Here's some money for some Alaskan king crab. It has been an incredible past few days. Bruce Campbell buying dinner for us yesterday. Jeez Louise, guys, incredible. Thank you so much, Bruce McAbee. Thank you so much guys, thank you Bruce Campbell, thank you so much Katie for gifting memberships to those who can't become a member. Thank you so much guys for spreading the love here on LA Flights. Alaska 114 flying to Seattle, Washington, a 737. 900 CFM 56 engines on those, on that 73. Thank you, William. That's a $20 super check coming in. Maybe Anchorage could be the new home of LA flights. All right, I've been saying this for the past few times. Okay, so last time I was here, I was saying this, uh, let's see, this is the second home of LA flights. What do you think? LA flights will always call Los Angeles home. That's our home base, our headquarters, Bad Bridge, the official headquarters for LA flights. I think, uh, let's see, I really do think this Anchorage, uh, Anchorage Airport, right? We have one, two, three different locations. This could be our second home. What do you think? Am I wrong with that? Anchorage Aviation, $5 Super Chat coming in. I saw that UPS 747 from my house. That one just departed. Thank you so much, Anchorage Aviation. So nice to meet you the past few days. I'm sure you know this location. Anchorage Aviation, if you want to come by, it'll be nice to see you again. If not, enjoy the planes. Enjoy the planes here on LA flights. How many, let's see, how many do we need? We need only 70 to go, 70 more likes to cross 1,000. It could be the second quickest time we've ever reached 1,000. I'll take that any day of the week. I think that's a good one. Thank you so much, Robert. A 199 super sticker. Incredible beginning to the show. What a way to begin the show. And the action doesn't stop. That's the good thing. The action doesn't stop. We have UPS, a 747. That one, the big one. That's the Dash 8. And a triple seven taxiing on Yankee. That big taxiway, the one that the 747 is on. Yankee. The runway that we were at yesterday, right? Runway 33. 
where we had the incredible action just lifting off right in front of us. That runway, uh, runway 33, closed for the entire day. So we had to improvise today. And we drove around the airport trying to find a different location. And I think we found a good one. I think we found a good option. The show was canceled today, but, you know, we improvised. And here we are. We had to bring the planes to all of you. We had to celebrate the third day in the Anchorage special. We had to do that. Hey, Pilatus. 41 minute flight for that one. All right, I think it's time to go to the UPS 747. 747-8, I'll be surprised if this one is flying anywhere but Louisville. And yes, it is flying to Kentucky. That's the Learjet that was taxiing right next to us. The Learjet. I was waving like a wa uh, madman, by the way, trying to get the attention of the pilot, trying to get a wave back. Did not work. It did not work. That's another one. Crossing runway 33, another 747. Why not, right? Why not? I love this comment. You're absolutely right, Katie. Anchorage, the LA Flight's second USA home. Sydney, LA Flight's the international second home. I completely agree with that assessment, Katie. We love Sydney. We love Anchorage. We also love New York City. That's a grand caravan, isn't it? Pump up the sound, everybody. Pump up your sound. I will be muting your host and I will be waving like a madman. I'm telling you guys, I'm telling you, it's such a difficult location to be broadcasting. Uh, it's so hard to be, it's, the internet connection is virtually non-existent from this location. We're doing our absolute best. Let's go for it just in time for that 7-4 departure. Flying to Kentucky this afternoon, 747-8. Let's go where? There's so many things to see right now. So many things to see. And I do say again, if you see that buffering wheel, we'll be back in just a few seconds. No internet connection here at this location. We're doing our absolute best. Thank you, guys. Let's enjoy the freighters. We have two of them on Taxiway Yankee. We have one, we have two UPS 74s, and get ready, I'm gonna show you one more arriving on seven rights. It's Kathy.
All right, let's go to the triple seven. Getting a move on, let's go for it. Due to the internet connection, I don't want to be buffering all afternoon, so long, uh, all afternoon long. So that means we're gonna get this afternoon rush, and then we'll be we'll be calling it a day. Incredible location. I filmed. Let's see. When I say I filmed, I mean Joshua filmed like three hours worth of content earlier in the morning. So we have a lot of 4K footage. We'll be publishing that to all of you in the coming weeks. So we will see this location in 4K. Sadly, I think I'm just going to get the afternoon rush. Like I said, everybody, I think we're just going to get the afternoon rush and then we'll just call it a day. It's buffering pretty bad. 747 incoming and UPS lining up on 7 left. We might have a double 747 shot. Are you ready? One arriving and a UPS, the one that you see on your screen, still waiting on 7 left. Hey, can't get ready with that double 747 shot. This might be the thumbnail of today's broadcast. Short one, I know, copy that. A short show today, but at least we got to see it. Kathy Pacific, that one just arrived. That's a Dash 8. Let's go to the one taxiing for departure. This is a new one that's Korean Air. Korean Air flying to O'Hare International. That's Korean Air 233.
that one flying to Kentucky. We're going to go to the little one, getting a move on. This is the one that we saw pretty close to us. A Pilatus getting a move on, lifting off on seven left. things to see right now. All right, can we go to Korean Air, please? Air flying to O'Hare International. There's going to be a little one departing right in front of it. Go for it, Cat. Oh, hold on a minute. Go for it. Are we gonna go now? Can we go to the arrivals, please, Cat? Can we show what's coming in? We have a triple seven freighter, FedEx fifty two thirty six, flying in from Indianapolis. It's in the distance right now. Number two for arrival, landing in I think. Let's see, landing in about one minute, maybe one or two minutes. A little far away, but I think it's a okay. All right. 
Let me know, is this not despite the internet connections? Copy that. It's uh, pretty difficult from this location. But is this the best location that we've ever been at? Let me know if this is the best location. Despite the internet connection, I think it's just simply uh, it's pretty good, pretty cool. Hey, Ken, can we focus the camera, please? Copy that, thank you. New Cat Hill will block the arrival. Let's go to the 175. Taking off. Let's go for it. Oh, I got a special treat for all of you. Let's go for it. It's on the Hercules, everybody. What do you think? And Josh will giving you the close up and finishing up the close up with some rudder spotting. Thank you so, uh, thank you so much, Thomas, sending us a $10 super chat. The sounds at this site is almost better than Bad Bridge. Keep it up. Thank you so much, Thomas. So, Thomas, I think, preparing the sounds from this location. What are we going to name this location? We got to think about that. This will be the second home. Thank you so much, Robert Maynard. $25 Super Chat. Don't give up. The buffering hasn't been as bad as you think it is. You got over 2,000 people really enjoying the show. And, uh, and as even with a few hiccups, we're fine, guys. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you so much, Robert. Right now, my computer's so dim, I can not I can barely read your message, Robert. Thank you, friend. Words of encouragement and, and an amazing Super Chat. Thank you, Governor Vogel. Thank you for the wonderful 747 show. Thank you so much, friends. Let's go to the Hercules. All right, it's out of here. Pump up the sound. I'm doing that. Hercules, getting a move on.
Alaska Airlines 169er flying to Kodiak. Thank you so much, Bruce McAbee, a five Aussie super chat. Peter, thought you would like to know that Lufthansa are bringing back some of their A380s. Also, what time is sunset there? I've heard the Lufthansa news, but keep in mind with any schedule, anything is, uh, anything is um, subject to change. So hopefully we'll cross our fingers and we get to see that massive plane once again. Sunset here at our location happens at 11.50. Hold on a minute. 11.40 p.m. Very late and it never really gets fully dark. Mr. Robot getting angry at Robert there. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, Mr. Robot. Jeez Louise. Robert sending us an incredible $37. 35 tip to celebrate the incredible action that started off the third day in the Anchorage special. Come on, Mr. Robot. Jeez Louise. Alaska 169er getting a move on, flying to Kodiak. A 737-900. Thank you so much, Northern Charger, sending us a $7 tip. Just being able to hear the GE90s whine as they spool up makes this the best location ever. Now we do have incredible sound from Cat Hill. Don't forget that we also have incredible sound from Bad Bridge, our home base. But certainly this one right here, our second home, simply amazing. From the 737, all right, we're gonna get the departure. I have a special plane to show you. It's a rocket launch. It's going to be a rocket launch in just a few minutes. Alaska 116 flying to Seattle, Washington, a 737 lifting off. That one, the 700 model. You don't normally get to see the 700 models. Let's go to the rocket launch. Well, hopefully it's going to be a rocket launch. It's FedEx, a MD-11, crossing a runway 33. Runway 33 closed for the day. Now we were supposed to be right in front, directly in front of that FedEx MD-11. That location, that's where the liftoffs happen, right in front of you on runway 33. The location that we were at yesterday and Saturday. But the thing is, runway 33 closed, there is no action happening in front of you. All the action is happening here on this side. We had to improvise, so we drove around Anchorage, and we luckily found this location. The thing is, the inter internet strength is not 
what I want. So I'm battling internet strength. I'm doing my absolute best to continue to stay live. And we will stay live for, I think, a short while longer. MZ11, very far away. Let's see, the afternoon heat is coming in. The heat is rising from the runways, causing a lot of heat waves in the distance. It's a hot, well, it's starting to be a sunny afternoon here in Anchorage. Thank you so much, Ryan. Uh, celebrating two months with LA Flights Live. Exciting, enjoying the show. Thank you so much for joining the LA Flights family, Ryan. Thank you so much for renewing your membership this afternoon. All right, let's see. MD-11 rocket launch, right? Let's send some rocket vibes to that MD-11. Hopefully we get to see an early lift off on runway seven left. How do we send the rocket vibes? I think we can send the rocket vibes by leaving a like and subscribing to LA Flights if you haven't done so. How about 1,700 likes? That's 300 away. It's going to be a little bit of an ambitious like challenge, but I'm going for it. 1,700 likes if you haven't done so. Go for it. Let's send some rocket vibes to that MD-11. Take off 7 left, get extra departure, Alaska 153. Uh, Tower Razor 961, uh, just for your planning, we are going to uh, North Air Park, back to you. Hey, 961, Roger, plane call. Big news, big news. We're only like a few subscribers away from crossing 112,000 subscribers in the channel. Only a few more if you haven't done so, go for it. Subscribe to the channel, it's completely free. Make sure to hit that notification bell. You will not miss one second of my crazy adventures. Today we're in Anchorage. Where are we going to be next? Where are we gonna go for the month of July? You won't miss one second if you're subscribed and if you hit that notification bell. Remember, completely free. Completely free to subscribe. Alaska 153 flying to Nome, Alaska. That's a 737. 800. 10 years of age for the 737 Alaska that you just saw leave. Seven Let's go to the possible uh, rocket launch. How many likes do we need? Oh, we, it's a little far off. How many? 120 to go. Lightning round. 120 to go to cross 1700.
What do you think? Rocket? I think that was our first rocket. Let me know if you agree with me. I'm pretty sure I can classify that one a rocket. Northern Air Cargo, a 737 arriving on 7 right. We'll get that one exiting the runway right in front of us. Cat Hill, new Cat Hill blocking the arrival shot. If it's not trees, it's hills. Let's go to that 737 Delta. Flying to Seattle, Washington, that 7-3. Delta 2471. Thank you so much, Dustin. Celebrating six months, celebrating five months in all access VIP. Dustin Jackson, a VIP here on the channel. Hope you guys have a blast in Alaska. Thank you, friend. Yeah, a little buffering issue, everybody. This location is not the friendliest location. We're doing our absolute best. If you see that buffering wheel, we'll be right back. Just give us a few seconds. Buffering wheel, we'll be right back. Just give us a few seconds. Now, if runway 33 was open, we would be at the different location. We'll be at the location that we were at yesterday. The signal, the internet strength, it's a lot better from that location. Sally, from this one, it's a struggle, it's a fight. But we are here doing our best and get ready. We have another rocket launch coming in. Okay, short of seven right echo. Not that one. Hold on, Joshua panning the camera, zooming out, panning the camera and zooming back in, this time to an MD-11 crossing runway 33. An arrival looks like a Learjet, yes? Learjet and arrival on seven right.
back again. We're going to end the show with MD-11, everybody. That was the big one. That was a big buffering event. All right, so we're going to end with MD-11. You got a nice look at this location. Our second home. Our second home here in Anchorage. Next time will be from the more friendlier locations. We're going to get that rocket launch after that. We end the show, sadly. AJ, two dollars super chat. Thank you so much, my friend. How about satellite feed for LA flights? Starlink doesn't offer services in Los Angeles. Starlink does not offer services here in Alaska, sadly. A lot of viewers went away, but hopefully they tune back in to see the rocket launch happening in just a few minutes. Before we go. Are you ready? We have Henry flying above. Well, Henry in Alaska, can we zoom in? Let's see if Joshua sees little Henry. Henry in Alaska. Can you, can you guys see it? Let's see. Henry a little far from us. I hope you guys can see it. My computer is so dim, forget about it. I can't see anything. Grand Caravan arriving on seven. Right, let's go to the one more plane, to the last plane for today, because I am sick of this buffering issues. Let's go to the one more plane. Let's go to the rocket launch. And that's true. I, I shouldn't have missed the flight. Uh, we have a flight happening in just a few hours. We have to go back to Los Angeles. That's absolutely true. I shouldn't have missed the flight. We got a lot of 4K content here. It's going to be pretty cool. We're going to be publishing that for the members and we will also be publishing 4K content for all the viewers to enjoy as well. I think let's go to the Salt Falcon then. Let's go. Getting a move on.
Executive jet getting a move on. All right, let's go to the one more plane. Let's go to the last plane of the LA flights broadcast. Day three of the Anchorage special. Today's special was canceled, but we improvised and we at least got an hour in. Give me the rocket launch. All right, we're back. Engine's cutting out. Will it be a rocket launch lifting off MD-11? Let's finish the show with at least a rocket launch. Are you ready? I spy a C-17. Let's go for it. Flying in the distance. You want to go for it. C-17. Very far away. It's in the distance. Not landing here at this airport. Show is pretty much over, everybody. Thank you so much for joining us here on the LA Flight's third day special. Sadly, runway 33 was closed down on us. We have three different connections right now working and three different carriers providing signal and nothing. Is it getting a little smoother, hopefully? Less buffering? What do you think? It's a little smoother, hopefully. You know, if it's running a little smoother, uh, let's see, the rocket launch was the last plane of the day. Do you want to stay for just one more? Only if it's running smoothly, though. All right, I think we can go to the one more plane. Euro Wings, it's an A330. We saw this, well, I saw this one arrive a few hours ago. Now we're going to see it leave. Thank you so much, Stephen. $10 Super Chat coming in. Thank you for what you're doing for us. And you know, this would have been a lot better if we were at the other location, runway 33. I think better shots from this location, but the thing is the internet, internet strength, not our friend. Craig, is that a fact? Do we have a DC-3 arriving? Yes, we do. We have a DC-3 arriving on 7 right. I will stay for that one as well. 
Right, so we're gonna stay with four, we're gonna stay for DC3 arriving in just a few minutes, and we're going to stay for the departure of that A330 on your screen. Let's go for a DC-3. New Cat Hill will block the arrival. That one should be taxiing right in front of us. So we should get a pretty close look at the DC-3. We saw this one depart yesterday afternoon from the other location, from the more friendlier location. Uh, you know we're the home of the one more plane, right? I always find any reason to extend the show. Can, can we take a look at the other uh, plane right behind the A330? Cat's a little busy, give him a few seconds. Zooming out and zooming into the one more plane, to the one one more plane. Thank you, William. Thank you so much, William, sending us a $10 tip through PayPal. Thank you so much for using PayPal, my friends. Thank you so much, Samuel. Cheers, LA Flights family. Thank you so much, friend. Also a $10 tip. Thank you, guys. Let's go to the DC-3 already touched down. New Cat Hill, a obstacle, an obstacle. Oh, that's a pretty sight. That's the thumbnail for today. That's it. That is the absolute thumbnail for today. That's a DC three. A DC three. Try and say. Try saying that with the retainer. Oh, that's such a pretty sight. I don't want to leave it alone. Uh, let's stay with the DC-3. We have Euro Wings, the one more plane for tonight. Getting a move on, about to line up on runway three, correction, seven left. Oh, we're going to stay with that. Go for it, Cat. Let me know if that was the right call. Stay with the cat. I want to stay with it. We have a lot of action happening right now. <laughs> the A330 already lined up and ready to go. All right, we're going for it. We're going to go for the one more plane for tonight.
Okay, can we go to the one, one more plane lining up right now? Let's go to the 747. It's a UPS 74. Flying to Ontario in Southern California, Ontario International. All right, I think with that, we end the show. I think with that, we end the show. DC3 uh, DC there, but you're going to see me instead. Well, sorry about the shock, everybody. Um, so you know me, right? I, I do my best to stay for as long as we can. Is my mic on? Yes, it is. But with the internet connection, the internet struggle here, it's just, it's just a fight that I want. I don't want to keep fighting everybody. I do hope you had a good time here on the Anchorage special. We were live Saturday. We were live yesterday. We're live again today. We're doing our absolute best. We'll, be, we'll be back in Los Angeles later this week uh, doing the live shows from the home base of LA Flights. Anchorage, uh, pretty cool. Uh, pretty cool, everybody. We have two carriers feeding internet signal right now to us. And we're barely, barely reaching 20 uploads, so it's a struggle. Uh, other locations are more friendlier. Let's go to one more, just one more. And after this, I think we will have to end the show. Let's go for it, Kat. Go for it. You know, I ran a test. I ran a test show uh, before we went live. I went live 45 minutes without a hitch, without a problem. I was so excited to go live. And oh boy, what happens when you go live? The unexpected. The unexpected happens, everyone. Hey, Kat, can we go finish the show with the DC-3? I think this is a good way to end the Anchorage special. Let's go to the DC-3 again. Don't worry. You're not going to see the host again. You're going to see the DC-3. Uh, let's go for it. Joshua locating the plane and zooming in. Very far away from our location right now. Getting very quiet right now. At least we got... An amazing hour of action. We started the show with like what six, seven, seven, four, seven. I've, I lost count. I have lost count. As you can see, I'm trying to fight it, but I, I would stay for like another million hours. I really would.
All right, one more arrival. It looks like a prop. Now that I'm going to end the show, now everything is running smoothly. Sure. Anything else coming in? Let's see. We do have a 747 arriving in 24 minutes. After that, let's see. Oh boy, it gets a little quiet. Okay, so I think we reached slow hour here in Anchorage. Hey, Cat, is that Cathy Pacific transponder on? Arrived 55 minutes ago, but I think that, that one will not be leaving anytime soon, sadly. A good rush, I think that was a pretty good rush of planes. All right, pretty quiet, and signal might be cutting out a little later on. Thank you so much for joining, everybody. This is the final goodbye. Okay, one more. Uh, okay, this will be the last departure of the LA Flight Show. Let's take advantage now that everything works, now that everything is running smoothly. The last departure for the Anchorage Special. We have filmed hours and hours of content in 4K, and we will be publishing that for all of you to enjoy in the coming weeks. On to the next adventure, everyone. On to the next adventure. Thank you for joining the LA Flights family as we take the show, as we take the home of the one more plane to Alaska. Hold on. What's, up? What's flying above us? What do we have above us, Cat? Hey, we have a seaplane. All right, guys, final goodbye. See you next time, everyone. See you next one. Bye-bye. See you on the next one. Bye-bye.